everyone, my name is Mel. I'm the lead bar fitness educator here at Bar Fitness. Today I have a really fun resistance band upper body workout. Now if you don't have a resistance band at home, that's okay. You can either use light weights or you can even just go through the movement without weights. So let's get started with the warm up. You're gonna take that resistance band and you're gonna bring your feet out just a little bit wider than your hips. You're gonna take the handles either A to your hips, to your ribs or up towards your shoulders, depending on how far you'd like to take this. I'm gonna choose the harder option. So from here, you're gonna take your weight back for two, and then you're gonna actually you're gonna rise back up. Same thing, we're gonna go nice and slow. I really want you to focus on resisting. So resisting on your way down, and you're resisting on the weight. You have two more like this. And from here, you're gonna kick your leg out towards the side. So let's go down for two. Exhale, find your balance and kick your leg side. Same thing, other leg. And then kick out towards the side. Same thing, inhale down for two. And then exhale, we'll kick. One more like that. Let's pick our tempo up a little quicker. We're gonna go inhale, exhale, kick. Go down and reach. So you can feel the outer seat muscles, outer thighs are starting to engage. You have four. Stand up a little taller, really engage that core. Let's go for two. Hold your next one at the top and pause. Keep a little bend through your supporting leg and start to pulse your other leg out towards the side. This is really good for practicing your posture and practicing your balance. You have eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, transfer to the other side right away. Kick that leg out and up. Whoops, sometimes you fall over, that's okay. Find that little bend through that supporting knee. Little tiny pulses. Let's go for eight, seven, six, five, you have four, three, two, and one. Nice job. All right, from here, roll those shoulders back. We're gonna step one foot into the resistance band. Double check that your hands are the same height. You're gonna take your heel, line it up with the middle of your arch, and then slide it out nice and wide. We're gonna start the elbows in alongside the rib cage, and your knee will be bent. Just double check that knee is pointing towards your second and third toe. From here, we're gonna reach forward with both arms. Reach forward for two, and then bring the arms back in. Three more, reaching forward and inhale to return. Let's find that exhale, exhale forward, and come back in. You have one more like this, reach, and then come all the way back in. Reach your next one forward and pause here. We're gonna take a little bend and stretch of our elbows, a little bend, stretch, bend, stretch. Let's have a small little pulse down towards the floor, little bend to that knee, little press, little press. You have eight, seven, double check that core is still nice and strong, you're lengthening up nice and tall. Let's go for four. For three, from here, slowly take those arms out wide. Open up. For two, close back in. So as I'm doing this, I'm keeping a little bend through the elbows. That's gonna protect your elbow joint. Open for two, come back in. Good, you have one more like this. Hold this one out towards the side. Let's go for a little bend and stretch. You have 16, 15. Add that little pulse again through your leg. Little bend, and then your shoulders should be on fire right about now. You have eight, seven, six, Five, let's go for a four. Now we're not quite done. From here, you're gonna take your hand to your thigh, lean over into a diagonal, bring your elbow to your rib. You're gonna go up for two counts, and then you're gonna tap that elbow back down. Same thing, keep your chest nice and open. Reach, tap that elbow back down. Reach up and over, and tap back down. Let's take one more here. We're gonna hold our next one at the very top. Hold this one on the diagonal. From here, we're gonna move into some tricep work. You're gonna bend the elbow, Bring that resistance band behind your head and rise. Inhale, down for two. And exhale, rise back up. Let's go two more, down for two. And rise, one more here. We're gonna lower down for two. Lifting back up, take your next one, hold and hover right behind your head, little pulses. We're gonna go 16, let's have that small little bend again through your leg. Little tiny press, now keep your bicep nice and close to your ear. Hug it in, you have eight, seven, six, five, let's go for four, three, Two, and last one, very nice. All right, walk those feet and roll those shoulders back. We're gonna go to the other side right away. So you're gonna step your other foot into the resistance band. Again, double check those handles at the same height. From here, line your heel up with the middle of your arch and step that foot out nice and wide. Bend through your knee and bring those elbows right alongside your rib cage. Let's go from the top. Reach forward for two, and pull back in. So this is a little different than some of our other videos. I really want you to resist. You're gonna feel that band trying to pull you down towards the floor. Reach forward. Come back in. Nice, hold your next one at the front. From here, I want you to take a little bend and stretch. Reach forward, reach forward. 
forward and forward, a little bend through that leg. You have eight, seven, six, five, let's go for four, three, from here two counts to open the arms, open up, for two, resist back in. Again, we're keeping those elbows nice and soft. Notice if you start to stretch your leg, I want you to come right back down. Stay deep in that position. Your legs are in an isometric contraction the whole time. So they're working even though they're not moving. Hold this next one side, a little bend and stretch, press. And press, so let's go for 16, 15, 14, 13. We're bouncing out those sides, come down a little lower. You can do it. You have eight, seven, six, five, you have four, three, Remember, we're not quite done here. Take that form, reach down to the thigh. Elbow comes into the rib. We're gonna go on that diagonal. And then come back down. See, if you're watching me, you wanna see, you're going really long here, right on that diagonal. Let's go, two more times. Reach, tap back down, reach. Now pause on this one. We're gonna rotate in, bend the elbow here, down for two. Exhale, reach. So you're trying to really engage right into those triceps, right into those muscles facing me. Press back up. Inhale, down for two. Woo, resist back up. Take that next one down, tiny little pulses. It's up that little bend. Into that left knee again, little squeeze. Remember, we wanna keep our shoulders down here. It's just you and me here today. You got this. Keep breathing, you have eight, seven, resist. Resist, you have four, three, two, last one. From here, walk it in. Roll those shoulders back. All right, let's work that back a little bit. So you're gonna bring your feet hip distance apart, cross the resistance band one in front of the other. So option one, you can hold onto the handles. If you'd like to make this a little harder, you're gonna walk your hands through the handles and pull up just a little bit tighter so you've got a little more tension. Let's start with a little bend through those knees. Hinge forward, I'm gonna turn side so you can follow along a little easier. From here, you're gonna pull those elbows wide, draw the shoulder blades together, and then reach forward, same thing, exhale. And then forward, keep going here, I'm gonna face you again. We're gonna pull those shoulder blades together, and then reaching forward. Let's take one more slow like that. Let's go into eight singles, here we go. Exhale, pull back, eight, forward, seven. Working that back body is so good for your posture. These days, we're always on our phone, our computers, and this is just gonna help really open up through the front body, contract through that back body. Let's go for two, pull that next one at the top, little tiny pulses, here we go. Pull back 16, 15, 14. These are small, but intense contractions. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. You're almost done, you have eight, seven, six, five, last four, three, two, and one. Great, roll those shoulders back. All right, one of my favorite exercises. We're gonna take those handles right into our hand. You're gonna bring those feet hip distance apart now. Your posture, a little bend through those knees. Your spine is nice and neutral. We're gonna curl up for two, and then just lower halfway down. Same thing, lift for two. So as I do this, I'm really squeezing into the biceps. Control. We're gonna go one more time like this. We're gonna go into eight singles. Here we go, exhale, lift. And lower, I want you to hug back for it. Keep growing up nice and tall so that it's more than just the bicep workout. It's a whole body working here. Reach and resist. We're gonna go for two. Let's take a few quick. Here we go, curling up and up. Now your band might be easier than mine. If it is, I want you to walk those hands down on that band. Now if they are tighter than mine, if you have a brand new band, you may wanna take one of those handles like so into the other hand. Let's go down an inch and come back up. So right now, I have half that resistance. Totally up to you, as long as you're feeling it, you know you're doing a good job. Let's lift, you have four, exhale, resist. For three, shortening that range of motion for two. Let's go back to full range, right here. We go one inch below the elbow, one inch above. Inhale, exhale. So we're working into some endurance strength right here. You might even feel a little bit of shakiness. That's okay, just breathe. You have two more. Here's our finish, nice, quick, and small movements. Go down and lift, down, lift, and lift. Really important that you're breathing here. Let's go for eight, seven, six, five, you have four, three, two, and one. Awesome job, shake that arm out. Then we gotta do the other side. So switch that band over into your other foot. Double check those handles are the same height. Bring that elbow right in. Again, find that nice bar posture. And let's start with our curl up. Here we go, curls for two counts. And then just lower right halfway down. Same thing, exhale to curl. And lower back down. Rising up for two. 
and come back down. You have one more like this. Exhale, resist. Let's go into a few singles. Here we go, curling up and down. Squeeze and resist. Again, we wanna try and make this a little bit harder than it actually is. Squeeze and resist. You have four. Squeeze for three. We lift for two. Let's take a quick set. Here we go, we curl up and up and up and up. Resist, resist, resist. Eight more times, lifting eight, seven, six, five, and four. We're gonna go one inch below that elbow crease right here. Go down an inch, squeeze up an inch. So shortening that range of motion, but taking it a little closer towards the floor. Inhale and exhale, let's go for four. Little lift, squeeze for three. Little lift, you have two. Back to that full range of motion. Lift, you have eight. Squeeze, rise, and seven, and squeeze. You're almost done this upper body workout. Go for four, squeeze, for three, take it up, for two. Here is your finish, nice and quick. We take it down, squeeze, down, squeeze. This moment should feel really challenging. If it's not, you know what to do. Walk those hands down on that band a little bit more. Find that tension. Let's go for four. Three, two, and one. Really nice, roll those shoulders back. Let's reach those arms up overhead. Big breath in, as you exhale, take a little side bend up and over. And coming right back to center. Lift up, reach over to the other side. Beautiful, we're gonna open up through those chest muscles. Take your hands a little bit wider on that band. Start to reach those arms back. Lift up towards the ceiling. And then last one, reach around that spine, curl the belly in. Awesome job today. I hope you had a really great time. Check out some of our other videos if you'd like to elongate your workout today. Otherwise, keep checking back in. Every single week we have a new video coming your way. Thanks again, like, subscribe. Mwah.